Eagles own demilitarized zone, DMZ, is a place that bears the tragedy of the time and the past. On June 25, 1950, the invasion of South Korea by the North began with earth-shattering sounds of artillery. Although North and South Korea established their own governments after World War II, the peace didn't last long. Revealing its ambition to conquer South Korea, North Korea started the Korean War in alliance with the Soviet Union. The war had turned the entire nation into ruins, resulting in over 3.9 million deaths. This war among Koreans was a true tragedy. Agreement signed in Panmunjom on July 27, 1953. It led to the formation of the DMZ around the military demarcation line to prevent the war from starting again. <coughs> but even after the armistice agreement, North Korea dug underground tunnels below the demarcation line in order to invade South Korea. In 1974, an underground tunnel was discovered 1.2 kilometers south of the demarcation line, which is 8 kilometers northeast of Guarangpo, Yuncheng, Gyeonggi-do. This is the first tunnel. On March 24th of the following year, 1975, the second tunnel was discovered 13 kilometers north of Chodwan, Kangwon-do. And on October 17, 1978, the third tunnel was found. Discovered 435 meters south of the demarcation line, which is 4 kilometers south of Panmunjom. The third tunnel is big enough for 30,000 soldiers and artillery to pass through within one hour. Within the tunnel, there were clear evidences of the tunnel being planned to be used to invade South Korea. March 3, 1990, the fourth tunnel was found 26 kilometers northeast of Yonggu, Gangwon-do. North Korea was intending to use these underground tunnels for simultaneous full-scale attack on multiple fronts, causing critical damage to South Korean forces and nationwide panic. In addition to the four tunnels already discovered, it is expected that there are many more tunnels that haven't been found. North Korea is provoking us endlessly, using tunnels underground, as well as on land and sea. North Korea's provocations are becoming ever more aggressive and intricate. The attack on naval ship Chana and bombing of Yunkyungdo in 2010 was more than provocation. It was a declaration of war. And above the tunnels, there is the DMZ. of migratory birds and for everlasting peace the DMZ lives on the DMZ is a paradise for
for moose, goats, and wildflowers. From Chinese geese to eagles, and rare birds such as white cranes, herons, and black-faced spoonbills. The DMZ is a land of life, where wild animals live in harmony. The Miracles of the MZ is now changing once again and spreading its popularity in the world. Developed into a tourist destination, the areas around the DMZ will heighten our security awareness and offer tremendous opportunities for people to coexist with nature. Beyond preservation of the ecosystem and tourism for emphasizing the importance of national security, the DMZ is becoming a symbolic space for the era of unification. Our painful history is buried in the DMZ and tunnels, but this is just another meaning for the hope and desire of reunification. We should learn the lesson that our painful history must not be repeated. Korea has overcome the pain of war and achieved miraculous economic growth. And another miracle that we must achieve as we pursue harmony and coexistence, unification. Until that day comes, the DMZ will be alive forever.